Hello, Tim from Fairplay now on the 15th of March, 2022. Quick little quiz for you. What have these countries got in common, these following countries, at least from Friday morning onwards? And the countries are England, Mexico, Iceland, Hungary, Ireland, El Salvador, Jordan, Saudi Arabia and a couple of others I can't remember but there are two or three other ones I think well the answer is that those countries are already or will by the end of the week be part of a very small exclusive band of countries that you can enter with absolutely no lurgy restrictions whatsoever and that is because the final ones uh, for England are being lifted as from 4 a.m this Friday morning the 18th of March and I think the only restrictions that there were were these passenger locator forms and also testing if you're unveed but even those are going so if you're sort of going from England and you're going to any of those other countries that I've just mentioned uh, let's say Mexico you can do the entire round trip uh, pretty much like it was 2019 without any of the nonsense so that is a step in the right direction as far as I'm concerned and it means that uh, even if you're like us, you can now have a foreign holiday in the sun if you want. And the only kind of uh, sort of slight bit of dodginess that I can see that might still be there is if you've got a muzzle up on the plane, uh, airports and that sort of thing. But I think if, especially if you're going to Mexico, because really uh, uh, a good percentage of people who, who have been going to Mexico over the last uh, few months have been people like us. And I think um, there's a British Airways flight that goes to wherever it is, Mexico City, I suppose it would be, uh, or maybe Cancun. And they, they're probably used to people not being uh, particularly amenable to uh, wearing muzzles so and I have seen some comments that uh, uh, people have been allowed to go on to uh, BA planes to Mexico without having the muzzle up so that's just a slight little thing there but hopefully even um, yeah the airlines will drop uh, uh, the muzzles before too long and that list of country countries that I've just uh, mentioned will grow as well until there's a lot more um, on there. Uh, let's hope that happens and let's hope it happens really really soon now on oh, it's high time isn't it and also I have heard that the um, sort of uh, uh, C virus regulations the lurgy regulations that were introduced in uh, you know about this time two years ago that uh, enabled all the restrictions to happen uh, they are to end uh, well they've either already ended or they're about to end in the next week or so very imminently and that's that's definitely going to be the case because that is the acid test when they started lifting restrictions here in England people were very dubious and were saying well you know the acid test is if they're going to drop the actual regulations which uh, enable all that stuff to happen in the first place so it looks like that is going to happen uh, which again is good news because it means they can't just uh, sort of reintroduce restrictions at the drop of the hat. They're going to have to sort of uh, do another act of um, Parliament and go through Parliament with a parliamentary vote. And hopefully there will be a few more rebels around this time who will kind of uh, sort of stop it from happening. Who, who knows? I don't know. 
but let's hope that is the end of the restrictions but having said that i don't know about you but i'm not sure i really want to go abroad not at the moment especially if you still have to muzzle up on on the plane and things and yeah i've kind of got used to just going away in this country and i've I don't know, I've got a vibe, a good vibe, um, that it's going to be a decent summer this year as well. We've already had a, a lot of decent weather already, and it's a very nice spring-like day today. Uh, temperature's up into double figures, just about. I've got a feeling in my gut that it might be a decent summer, so I think stays in this country, camping and uh, uh, what have you, a few sort of golfing trips away, in this country may well be in order and then providing all the nonsense doesn't come back in the autumn and next winter that might be when I uh, uh, me and Lorraine decide to go somewhere some destination that's a bit warmer so that would be nice start saving the pennies up a little bit for that anyway uh, good news I'm going to take any little bit of good news when I can take uh, when I get it and I just thought I'd share that with you. So it looks like uh, any restrictions that there are for coming back into England will be gone. And if you stick to those countries I mentioned, you can have an entire round trip, an entire holiday uh, without any nonsense. So I'll leave it there. Tim from Fairplay now. Thanks for watching.